We do a lot of uh, talking about Social Security, some of the other uh, programs out there. Medicaid is facing a huge crisis. Uh, Kaiser reported last week that enrollment in Medicaid has spiked to 48 million. Uh, that's 15.7% of the population. Since December 2007, 6 million new people have signed up for Medicaid, and it's only going to get bigger. Set aside the notion of the economy, and these are people who are signing up because of the downturn of the economy, employers canceling coverage, and people uh, being downsized and so forth. The uh, Patient Protection and Affordable Care Act envisions 16 million new people moving into Medicaid. Of its 30, 32 million or so new people with coverage, about half of them get it through Medicaid. It is an expanding program. Uh, Washington, in order to address some of the financial problems facing the states, uh, passed about 100, they spent about $100 billion on Medicaid. $87 billion out of the stimulus bill. I don't think all of that has been spent yet. Another $16 billion and another bill. About $100 billion. There has been an idea going around, sponsored by Families USA for some time, uh, that Medicaid spending is actu actually stimulus spending because you're putting money out there in the health care system and people are spending it. But we're not seeing a lot of stimulus result from that, and I don't think it's a very good economic idea. Um, the Patient Protection and Affordable Care Act actually insulates states initially from the Medicaid expansion, but that insulation is going to be moving away fairly quickly. That has got a number of the governors, as Grace Murray implied, um, uh, concerned about what's going to happen to their state. In order to begin to take a look at that, we're going to start with Christy Herrera. Christy is director of the Health and Human Services Task Force at the Amer American Legislative Exchange Council. Uh, she's been doing that for a number of years. She tracks what's happening at the states, and she's going to give us an overview of some of the things that are happening with states and Medicaid. And with that, Christy. Thank you. 